Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have got these two purple squares of different sizes as you can see in this figure such that this length AB is 5 times square root of 3. And now we are going to calculate the area of this whole purple shaded region. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's go ahead and take care of this large square over here. Suppose the side lengths of this large square be x since uh, all sides are same. So all sides are going to be x. And likewise the side lengths of this smaller square are going to be y. So this side is y, this side is y. Likewise, this is y and this is y as well. And here's our next step. Let's recall the area of a square formula. Area is always equal to s square where s represents the side length of a square. So therefore, the area of this larger square is going to be x square since the side length is x. And likewise, the area of this smaller square is going to be y square since the side length of this one is y. So therefore, the total area of this purple region, this area and this is going to be, we are going to add these two areas. So it's going to become x square plus y square. And now we are going to calculate the area of this purple region. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this triangle ABC and we know that this is a right triangle. So therefore we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem. And here's our Pythagorean theorem A square plus B square equal to C square. And in our this triangle the longest leg is this AB. I'm going to call this side C. And now let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. In our case our this side is X. So this is going to become X square plus this side is Y. So this is going to become y square and this longest leg c is 5 times square root of 3 whole square. Now let's go ahead and simplify this equation. So x square plus y square is going to be equal to this 5 square is going to be 25. 25 times this square and square root is gone times 3. So that is going to give us 75. And we know that the total area of this purple shaded region is x square plus y square. And here we figured out x square plus y square is equal to 75. So therefore we conclude that the total area of this purple shaded region equals to 75 square units. So thus the total area of this purple shaded region turns out to be a 75 square units. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.